All right, hey guys, we just shot a red squirrel here about hour, hour and a half ago. My Benjamin Trail MPXL 1100. Uh, he's about about 15 yard shot. I missed the first shot as he was running down the tree, and uh, then he stopped and was barking at me in the entrance. No, that's not it. It's right, uh, right here somewhere. You can't see it good, but where his uh, rigor mortis set in. It's right, right there somewhere. And then it came out right here. So it went right straight through his chest there. Lungs, maybe the heart. Uh, maybe even the uh, force of energy there may even have cracked the spine. And uh, yeah, as soon as I shot it, you heard the thwack of the pellet hitting the bone. and. He just kind of fell off the branch, his bottom half went limp, and he just held on with his front legs, and he dropped. And, uh, yeah, he was dead on arrival. Some snowmobiles driving by outside. But, yeah, that's pretty much it. If, for those of you that are wondering what this little white card is on my gun, that's a uh, chair gun, Pro. Uh, it's a free free download on your computer. I recommend anybody that does any shooting beyond 20 or 30 yards with an air rifle to download it. Got on one, one tier here is the range in yards and beside that on the right tells you how much it drops in inches. From I can't remember what I got set for like 10 to 80 yards or yeah 10 to 80 yards. That's with the uh, Beeman uh, is that Beeman? No, that's where the Barracudas. Right now I have it zeroed with the Crossman Premier Ultra Magnums. So that's kind of useless right now until I zero it back with the Barracudas. And uh, one other thing I wanted to point out. My stock, stock uh, screws here on the tra trail was loosening up. Causing the barrel to move I think and the shots just started spreading going haywire. So, uh, I'll show you guys what happened. I put some blue perma seal, something like that. Basically, same thing as Loctite on them. And the screws weren't even tight, but when I pulled them out, you can see where that bubbled right there. Cracked, cracked a little bit and bubbled. Nothing major, but just stock. Must not be very high quality. And, uh, cracked a couple times right there on that side, as you can see. But, um, yeah, so... You would think for Benjamin, this is pretty much their top of, line, top of the line brake barrel air rifle, that they would have a little bit better quality on it. Because uh, you'd think the stock would be better. You would think, I don't know, the scope's pretty good for this, I would say, for what I use it for. But uh, the trigger, it just plain sucks. I mean, it's got a lot of creep. The second stage is a mile long, and uh, yeah, it's just horrible. I do plan on ordering the GRT-3 trigger from Charlie DeTuna soon, and uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Alright, see you guys.